books that you can't put down because if you do, you'd be wondering all night what's going to happen next. If so, then the VFG is for you, 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 and all of you. The VFG by Ronald Dahl was wrote, was wrote in 1982, which would be one of his last books because he sadly passed away in 1990. But before that, he, before that, he wrote many books that mostly have the genre of children's literature. Friendly giant is not your ordinary giant. He, because he's too nice. Because he's too nice and humble to be one of those men eating bloodthirsty giants. Lucky for Sophie, because she because if she had been carried off by any other giant, she would have been gone in a second. But one day in giant country, when she hears that the giants are going off to eat some little chitterlings, she decides it's time to put a stop to this horrid act once and for all. My favorite part in the VFG is when Bloodballer, one of the nasty giants, uh, hears noises coming from his cave. So he barges into the cave and starts, and he and the VFG start searching his whole cave for some human beings, is what they call it. And then, finally, the VFG manages, manages to get him off topic and onto awful snozz cumbers, which are man-sized cucumbers that taste like Rotten dead fish and rotten frog skins. He gets blood bottle to try one and doesn't know that Sophie's hiding in there so that because she doesn't want to be eaten by him. So blood bottle takes a bite and he immediately spits all of it out, which then sends Sophie flying across the room and onto his clothes. That was my favorite part in the BFG. The theme of the BFG is even if you're small, it doesn't mean that you can't come up big. You can't come up with big plans. This is the theme because Sophie, she was pretty small. Well, to us, she's regular size, but to the giants, they're like 50 feet. You know? She's like a blade of grass, very small. But did her size let her, did, her size didn't let her stop coming up with plans and stuff. That's why that's the theme of this book. Her old dog, the number one storyteller, which means he had to have had a pretty creative mind to come up with all these books and characters. So, most notable of his books are mm -hmm. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, James and the Giant Peach, Matilda, and the BFG, of course, plus many more. As you can see, the BFG is a fictional story about a girl and a giant who strike an uncommon friendship. And then, so on my poster, the movie came out in 2016. Always have.